Oh, look at that! Friend to search. Uh, we're not gonna mulligan. This is fine. Because Tutip is missing? I know that, but... <coughs> you can actually sure. use it somehow. There's a way to do it. We have to go first. The card works. I just don't have the description. But we don't know how the card works. At least I don't know. What is it? <clears throat> yeah. Damage an enemy by one. If the highest unit on the battlefield, an ally damage it by three instead. So. This means that if we play this, and we are tied for the highest unit, at least I believe, then we can hit for free. Last time, it worked. When the, when the riders were played. Well, never mind that. Well, it makes sense. Like, this is what I would expect from that description, but... Last time my opponent played a rider into my king of beggars, that, that's 4 point, and he played a 4 point rider, he actually got out another rider. Which was surprising, but then I just assumed, like, oh yeah, that's how it works. But, that's not true. Two works, just no duplicates in deck. Thanks for that. That should be even harder to be, uh, satisfy. Here in Gwent. What's up with this? When this unit moves to the graveyard, summon it, you really want to do it too. I have to say the Necker Warriors are, warriors are pretty bad. They are not helping me whatsoever. I'm just gonna end turn. I don't like uh, how the UI works. Moves around. I can't see my cards now. Hmm, that might even be amusing. Discard a card, then draw a card. Whatever a special is discarded, damage and bite. Four. Play this. I play the warrior next. He's five points. Also, we got Siri, who's six points. Wait, what? Oh, he has three charges. Right. Hold middle mouse button. Oh. But still. I wanna... I want it to stay like this. It doesn't give me a lot of freedom. But we can just simulate an earthquake. No! Oh, stop it! Dirt search! I just need to... Well, this just seems like a lot of effort. Not worth it. Doesn't help. <laughs> Hmm. <laughs> 
Hmm. This for five. Click. Can I just play this for six first? Yield and save me some time. doing no time to celebrate Bran or the celebrating what's he do anyway discard a card then draw a card whenever we'll follow you always discard a card <laughs> we're just gonna keep playing trash there is no escape <laughs> That, that. I don't want to play my gold, but I want to keep, well, with the exception of Siri that we have to play. That's the only way it makes sense. If you play two gold, maybe more. Won't pay us in gold. These. In the this blood. unit is in the graveyard. Summon it whenever you play a unit from the graveyard. Yeah. Start. Phoenix is in the graveyard. Banish it. Spawn Phoenix. Did he just mess up? He's gonna pass. Ha <laughs> 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 Ah! This feels a bit weird. Can I just up the music volume? Because it just it just kind of feels like just two mo grown men grunting and shaking their fist at each other. Okay, we just need to up the music volume if we can. Oh, we're still not gonna mulligan. No, I don't want to forfeit. I need to change the volume. At least I, I think I need to change the volume. This. The Phoenix Hatchling. Don't you pester me. You go price winning cow. I can hit this for one. This would allow me to use bridges twice. Would that be enough? So this is four plus regis for two plus seven. That's not enough. Play this, but again, not perfect. I can go current tier plus cow. Not perfect. Playing Yennefer, a bit lame. Also, even if I go cow, we've got to play something else as well. I'm gonna go extra cow. Whatever. Let's hope he doesn't kill it. This is the last round. Fuck! <laughs> oh, never- oh. Uh, good one. Uh, thanks for pointing that out. Um, definitely did know that. Welcome back, home, madam. Uh, hello, mythic pilot. Making the same mistakes as ever. I mean, I am making it. <laughs> uh, it's okay, guys. Yeah, it's for one. You cross the wrong side. Then we can make her. <laughs> it would have been better to make uh, Yennefer Conjurer. This wasn't too bad either, but it was risky. And they really need some cough medicine. It just says, I promise you a quick death. That's all he does. 
Yeah. We can't hear you, Aradin. You gotta speak up. Oh, Siri Dash. Ho, ho, I sense trouble. <sighs> Do the other leaders speak? Because. Even Bran doesn't speak. This is awkward. This is. This is possibly. This is up there with the most awkward conversations I've ever seen in my life. Imagine just two grown men standing. Okay, he, he attempted to speak. But two grown men just grunting at each other for half an hour. That's pretty awkward. Your stream is lagging for me. I have no option to lower than 1080p. <coughs> is it lagging? I have zero drop frame. But I definitely take your word for it. Oh yeah, like... I'm streaming... Using, uh, well... 3000 kilobits per sec, zero drop frames on my end, but unfortunately I'm not a p partner, so uh, you guys don't have access to... Wait, what? What happened to my guy? <laughs> what happened? Each player discards the rightmost card in their hand. I plan to use that guy. Oh, hit. Ah! Almost forgot. Hi, Adam. Uh, what are your first impressions on Homecoming? That looks good. You can't really punish him if he doesn't play anything big. Will I have time to get my card from Siri Dash? Hope so. I plan to use that guy to hit this uh, onion head dude with the glorious mustache uh, for one, so then we can uh, play Regis. That. Black Rayla. Damage an enemy by the number of allied humans. <coughs> you have humans? <coughs> I'm humans. Oh, look at that! Looks good to me. Um, let's put it there. And that's a win, ladies and gentlemen. GG. I wanted to finish it. They, they always give up. Alright, we go second. And this is a pretty lame hand, but we're just gonna keep it all. <clears throat> Apparently, Shoop has the same requirements of all. But different decks. A bit different effects. Uh, we might try it. I'm not sure how would I make uh, such a deck. Actually, I should have uh, mulliganed uh, one of these guys. So he can use his ability every round. Whoa, what is that? Whenever you play a unit with that fish, trigger his ability. I need more information. Why is he 10? Oh, he got buff. Uh, I played knackers.
Still monsters, Adam? I don't know, you guys want me to play something else? I feel like that's a good approach to uh, getting acquainted with the game. Just make an okay deck, keep changing it, and uh, that's a good way to get to know the game. Oh, he's running a Deathfish uh, variant. Siri, have a bunch of other crap we need to consider playing. <clears throat> monsters for life? Yeah, that's how I start. I just, I just saw monsters, and I want to play monsters. Why not? I know monsters the most, so I was most curious about monsters. But I don't know what, which should be the next next faction we check out. I'm honestly torn between doing as you told. And trying out all possible decks, to be honest. I feel like I would be just too confused if I tried to do everything at the same time. And I feel like I don't want to do that anyway. I'm, I'm tempted to, but I don't want to do that anyway because... There's just really no rush. To figure out the game. So, I can pass. I don't want to, though. He's so strong. Oh. So he was... His ability triggered right away, plus he got boosted twice by the Fiend. is like nowhere currently it feels like wind music should I need to uh, turn to the camera and like this is the grunting maximum grunting some wind no music I can hear just no music whatsoever. So we're just gonna check out the music volume. What? What is that? 36 points? Oh, Foglets. I gotta play Siri anyway, don't, don't I? Get back Siri. Ho ho, I sense trouble. Actually, I can strengthen Siri as well. Hopefully, he's gonna play another card. What does Necker Warrior do? Uh, he thrives. Boost this unit by one whenever an ally with higher power is played. That's it. He's not that good. I only have him because I made a Vault Hunt deck. And uh, after finishing the Valtan deck, I realized that we had to put in more guys that are completely unrelated to Valtan. That put in these guys. 
put it on the guys as well. Uh, we have to go with the naked warriors as well because there's just nothing. Yeah, passes. Oh, we have to pass as well. Lost the round. Fortunate. I have to say, so far it looks pretty impressive. You could just try other monster archetypes, so we can get a full view of the faction. I don't know, maybe. Ah, uh, we need to kick one of the right. And we're gonna save some uh, uh, redraws for later. He's gonna play at least one card. Because he's gonna get it back. Sounds like a T Rex piloting a plane. TDR just got updated. Well, what are you waiting for? I need to up the music volume. We're just gonna check it out. The option. By the way, I'm pretty sure that I have. I have it at the same volume, but we're just gonna check. Oh, come on! It's really punishing. <coughs> that much if I could somehow play the rider that would be great uh, I'm gonna play the next <coughs> maybe Siri can't play the rider we will be able to play the rider isn't it? Not great. Now he's bad. <coughs> gonna play the most useless card we got. It's probably this. Quite the round right there. Okay, we got three bronzes. Pretty bad. Okay, let's see. Maybe not that. Hmm. Please don't give me a rider. Okay, that, that's fine, that's fine. I start, and I'm gonna start... I can start two ways. I can start three ways. I can start... I, actually, I have many starts. I can start by putting down the rider, we get 8 points. That's fine. Doesn't generate value. Uh, but if we have the lead at, at any point later in the game, we can just do that anyway. King of Beggars generates value, but doesn't really generate value because it's gonna go in the prize winning cow. So, I think the best option here is just simply... Well, we can play two ways, but if we want value... Actually, we don't have... We don't have a warrior anymore, so we don't have to play in the first room. I'm just gonna play this. No make escape. copy. Yang Khan. And make her immune. There you go. She's just gonna... 
generate some value in the long ground. Also works pretty well in a highest deck. Because we make sure that the enemy doesn't have anything. I want to try some Witcher on Witcher action. Uh, deck. I hope the update fixes the MM. Witcher on Witcher action, right? Spawn a Harpy. Go with another Yen. Should they kill that? <coughs> I don't think we can. If I can hit it. That looks pretty cool. Two Yen Cons next to Karen Tier. What happened to your ship? You don't see your ship. Look at the ship! Look, the ship looks like trash now. What happened to the ship? Seriously. Don't you guys remember the ship? Oh no, it doesn't have. Wait. I'm. Mi Is this how he looked like? Oh, he didn't. You didn't have a ship up. I'm actually uh, mixing it up with the <coughs> big, big ship. But that ship looks fake. Hmm. So I'm just gonna hit. And hit again. Play King of Beggars. Maybe he's gonna. He wants to kill this cow. Because I'm just giving him targets that he wants to deal with. But his highest unit gets hit by two a turn. Highest units. Yet of a Conjurer is actually not much weaker than she used to be. Which makes her amazing. Oh no! Well done. Prize <laughs> winning cow. Uh, we're gonna save this. We possibly set up a crazy Regis play. Uh, play King of Beggars because it Who generates value. Spy? <sighs> a lot of points at this point. Anything helps. They removed the Bram Warrior from testing? They did? I saw it like hours ago. Currently has the Anharam. Well, she likes the bad boys. It kind of looks like a Steam logo, uh, painted green. Yeah, and also mirrored horizontally. Yeah, this is a Steam logo, painted green and mirrored horizontally. I have Steam open. The logo looks exactly like this. The only thing is missing like a little bit of something over here but yeah it's basically that don't kill it well i can't kill it So loud. Fine. I can play eight points with that. And that's another win. Basically, just play Yan, make her immune. Uh, don't forget to click on her every round. Done. GG.